Who let these hoes in my room? Who let these hoes? Who let these hoes in my room? Nah, bro, stop. Did you let them? <laughs> we ain't lying. Just there we are. We lying. Y'all let me clown like this. Somebody finna get fired. Hey. We oh, loud now. <laughs> oh shit, this shit is fucked up. Somebody finna get fired today. I swear it wasn't me. <laughs> well shit. Well anyway, y'all heard it. The new the new album is coming out called Girl I'm About to Nutting You. 13 tracks. Cop that shit. <laughs> what up everybody? <laughs> Chia. Traffic late then, man. This is some <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a festival or some shit. All it seems was a bunch of white people getting out of the cars. <laughs> <laughs> man, listen. It's like, but you should be used to this shit. White people getting out of cars? No, no, but that too. Sorry, no. <laughs> Onto my festivals in this motherfucker. Right, right, man. Because this shit is wild. Step, man, come on. Ain't that serious? Got me late. Yo, yo. Mm -hmm. she Mike said she check. gonna take it out of my check. Mike check. One, two, one, two. Everybody Shit, going. Everybody hell, going. Where's my check? Shit. It's in the motherfucking mail. I don't get paid enough for this. Um. Anyway. Good morning, everybody. Welcome, everybody. You are tuned <laughs> in to the Undrafted All-Stars. Undrafted. Radio. Where the fuck Sports the music show. at? Oh shit, we live Give right now. Give me some doses. I told you we were live. We used to talk shit. I know, shit. I was We're singing my What's song. What's up, everybody? Thank you for everybody that's tuning in Look, online. Thank you for everybody that's tuning in. My mama put me on this planet so I can sing my song, and I sang my song. The nigga went live and started singing. Did y'all hear that bullshit? <laughs> You are not American Idol material. I don't give a shit. <laughs> I'm an undrafted all star. All day. Dry your tears. We back. We in the building. It's a beautiful day. These niggas got on sweatpants and shit. Happy birthday, Peace. <laughs> Man, happy birthday, Peace. Hope you had a good one, bro, bro. Happy birthday, boys. We got on the space table on Tuesday and got our ass up on the first hand, but fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, shit, my fucking sugar guys. This motherfucker was out here. Purple weed, nigga. Him and Calvin was killing last night. Beating y'all ass. Hey, like shout out to Y'all better enjoy Calvin. that because that shit happened once every blue Boy, blue. we could not catch a good hand for shit. Like you stole some. Yeah, that all shit good. was horrible. I never lost all night. <laughs> I lost all night. Welcome to the right, table. I, play, I played That's four crazy. games and I lost four. That's crazy. Fuck that shit. I ain't lost like that since I was about 12. We're going to get this thing <laughs> popping, everybody. Thanks for tuning in to the Undrafted All Star Sports Radio Show. And I am your host. I'm song. Big Sue, aka Sleepy Dolce the Great, aka Mr. Tell Your Friends About Me, sitting here chilling in the hooch with my co host, Q Mecca, two techs up. I'm representing for the Hispanic community. I got Salinas, anything for Salinas <laughs> on my shirt. What's happening to the left of me? C4 Nate from 618. Starting this bitch off. I sang my song and I stand on it. Hey, Let's go. Mixtape coming. <laughs> we got a lot on the docket today. Want to give a shout out to Hot 702.5 FM. Yeah. FM. Download the app. Apple what Store, FM Google stand Play for? Store. That's right. Do anybody know what the FM stands for? Um, Fuck my life. Frequency, frequency mode. Frequency mode. Uh. <laughs> well, good. That shit sounds redundant, but cool. We're going to jump right into this thing. We're going to talk about your boy Tom Brady getting divorced. Tom say, fuck them kids and you, Giselle. Ah, I'm going to get I've been to motherfucking Tampa Bay, and all the women is Giselle's with nothing on. So fuck it. I'm divorcing you, and I ain't taking care of the kids. <laughs> Tom Brady, you, you can have it. You make more than me. I want half. Fuck. Hey, hey, if it was a black man doing this, they'd be like, oh, he's a deadbeat father. <laughs> He beat on it. Tom Brady, you lucky. All right. 13 years, bro. The only white people that get away with that shit is Tom Brady and Goku. <laughs> right. <laughs> God damn. 13 years, bro. He was like, you know what? I'm done with this shit. He retired. Came back and she was like, look. Nigga, I'm leave your ass. No, she told no damn where. You know what she was thinking? Because I know how women think. She was thinking this way. <laughs> Oh, niggas don't play till they 40. That's 40 is the lowly, longest in niggas play. Brett Favre. He gonna be done at 40. He did 40. 
She was like, he about to be done. 41? All right. 42? All right. When is nigga going to be done? 43? God damn it. Well, he was saying 45 and 42. So I know, she, but she knew. But she, right. but she was thinking, no, it ain't nobody ever done that, though. So she was thinking, True. nah, he ain't going to be done at 40. And then he kept going on her ass. Tom, Tom, Tom Brady getting hit too much, bro. Yeah, way too much. He about to be tired. He retired at the end. He, 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 he trying to get that 100,000 passing yards. True, but is That's he, what he trying to get. And he, he gonna why? Ask? He don't need to. But he already because, number one in everything. That he want to be number one in literally everything. But he is already. He, he, he don't want nobody to catch his ass. He got the most yards, right. most passes, <laughs> most touchdowns. Patrick most. Mahomes can still catch him, but he going to have to play just as long. I don't know if he going to play as long. <laughs> he's going to play until 45. hit like that, you know. Right. No, that nigga. That's if he key. play that long, that's two anomalies in one I don't even sport. think. Has Tom Brady <laughs> even been hit? 500 times in his career? No, he got the most hits. He, he got the most sacks. Dude. He got the most sacks. All, he just passed it. He passed it on Thursday. He just passed Roethlisberger. Yeah, on Thursday, yeah. 555 mm. sacks. That is sacks. But it took 20 years to get that. Yeah, that's I why. I mean, it was years he wasn't getting touched. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. But so those if those Pat- New years, So if Patrick Mahomes can have that same success well, that's where he that's hard, hard to, to have, bro. Then he could beat it. <laughs> that's he hard to have in football. He already had um. He's I think been, Patrick Mahomes at like twenty four thousand yards he already. Is protected though, he is and he protected. only been in a couple years. He is protected. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's true. Just like Tom Brady, I mean, but I, can, I can see it. I think we got, we got to let it play out, but I can see it. he ain't leaving Kansas City. He got no. five hundred million. No, and not I think at all. the way they keep stacking, but it's you know Andy Reid can't play it. I mean, coach as long as he can. You know what I'm saying? I mean, Andy Reid been So coaching. it's like after Andy Reid, it's like Andy, Andy, who do you get to keep that thing going like that? Yeah, that's that's a good question. Because I think Andy Reid probably got about three, four more years. I'm going to say if about, he keep winning about four. Yeah. Speaking yeah. of Andy Reid, I want to bring this up. Okay. His son, Britt Reid, remember that? Yeah, years I remember. Ago? He said, they, the, the court said he was drinking at the facility, and he said he wasn't when he heard that girl, that little girl. It was for the facility to where he hit that girl. It wasn't nothing in between that as far as places to go drink and none of that. So he was saying, I didn't drink at the facility. Like, motherfucker, guess you did. Yeah, but you got to say Then they admitted it. But now, if he gets in trouble, my whole thing is Andy Reid get fired for letting him drink in the facility? Hell no. They're going to find mm. a reason to not to have plausible deniability. I was I was in I was in the coaching room with film. He didn't want to watch a film with me. He must have went in somebody's desk and got the alcohol. He brought it his own. He He went in his daddy's desk and got it. (laughs) He brought his own. That's what they're going to say. And he's going to take the hit because that's what you do for your daddy who will been coaching Absolutely. for that long make millions right. of dollars. Yo, I brought my own drink in there. <laughs> I was, I had the whiskey and the bottle. I had Cisco. Ah, that's what made me do it. <laughs> Cisco. <laughs> the Cisco made Tom me Brady, do it. you going to have to keep playing now, bro. You sing go. <laughs> Tom Brady's going to be like Tiger Woods. He's going to get all the white girls and then be killed. All of them. <laughs> then when they tell them, we going to leave Tom no Brady white. alone uh, even though they trash. Three and five, bro. They don't look good at all. Terrible. Three and five, and they, and they got everybody. Well, they, they missing, got, they, they missing keep, they missing linemen, which we all know that's the most important thing True. on the team. They yeah. got, they and defense linemen. linemen, both on both sides. That's what they, they got. They, Shaq but, just got hurt. Nah, but who was there last year? They, uh, Omen Yusin, what the nigga name is? Omen Omen Yusin, whatever the nigga that played for. Oh, Dominic and Sue, Sue? Dominic and Sue ain't yeah. there. There's some niggas missing, and that's what no, no, tells no, no, you no. the line. They didn't sign Dominic and Sue. I know they should have. Okay, <laughs> you gotta go with what they got though. I oh, know, but you can't. It ain't the same as the Super Bowl. That's what I'm no, saying. No, I get and Gronk missing too. And Gronk, which is his, important. It's fucking outlet. Yeah. So it's not the same. The deep, the offensive line ain't protecting them. You have your core. You got Evans, right. Godwin, you Fournette, name all, and Brady. You name it all. Uh, the people that were there last year, skill down. players. That, no, that's what I'm talking about. Right. The skill what's players. the most important niggas it's on O line, bro? And D line, right? Okay. Both of those. But why you we got gotta, that? Okay. Why are we making this? Excuse for Tom Brady. Other people no, got all the line hurt too. Yeah. Know. The Bengals do too. Them, Dallas do too. No, the Bengals true. wouldn't pay niggas. They had last year. What I'm telling you is, it ain't no excuse when your line trash, your quarterback, and the wide receivers and all them skill players trash too, man. I agree. <laughs> That's what it is. Yeah. For Tom Brady, for God, Jesus, if he played, sorry. <laughs> and just say it. Check your ass. <laughs> he, he missing Giselle. And he Giselle. Don't he don't got her from last year. And she got the kids. <laughs> And she, he probably said, take them kids. Take I, ain't them. Watch I, I ain't want to come on to them anyway. <laughs> them little bad niggas, they ain't even athletic. 
Oh, we they gonna they move models on and shit. Thomas <laughs> Edward Brady, and we gonna move on to the Dallas Cowboys. Zeke yeah. got a great two MCL sprain. We'll be Damn. sitting out for the next for the next game. I mean, I gotta take them off my mother. It's the Tony Pollard show. Yep. Somebody trade me Tony Pollard thoughts, for Zeke. Zeke. <laughs> <laughs> shit, I'm with it. I like Tony Pollard. I mean, he get, getting all the carries. He's gonna Hell have nah. to. They well, probably they got probably pull somebody gonna, from the practice squad. No, they not. They gonna no, they throw that nigga the ball. Yeah, they already did. They gonna run the ball ten times but, but and throw it. What they gonna do? <laughs> what they gonna do? Nigga, he asked what C4 thought. Oh, my bad. <laughs> uh, no, nah, but um, I think they he'll probably get about. Cisco made me do it. 18, 18 to 22 carries. You're looking out, and Joe. Then the other, uh, whoever they pulled from the practice squad, probably get about 8 to 10. They pulled somebody. I forgot his name. I got to check again. But they pulled somebody. I know he can't carry, you know, the way they do running backs now. I got to be a two-headed monster. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, Tony Powell's going to get majority of the catches. I mean, he that. should. And I think he's going to do just fine. Michael I, Parsons, go ahead. My bad. No, I'm just saying. I'm gonna say he probably. I'm gonna. I'm gonna call. Tony Pollard gets about 18 touches. I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say more. Than 100 that. and 115 yards. I can get that. Total yards. Okay. Against the Bears, they missing. We gonna talk about that. They gave up one. They get lineman. Defensive lineman. He went to the Eagles. <laughs> Michael Parsons got a shoulder injury, but he said he gonna play. Jordan Lewis out with a foot injury for the rest of the season. Yeah. Cowboys yeah. traded with the Raiders. They always trading with the fucking Raiders. Jonathan Hankins and a seven round pick for a 2023 six round pick. Mm. Dallas is 20th against the Rush. Who y'all playing this week? We got the Bears. Yeah. The Giants trade. trade Kadarius Tony to the Chiefs. Oh, man, you get this nigga another weapon? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Tony Pollard is from Memphis. What up, Miss Dillon? Bears and the Patriots. Bears beat the shit out of them. Yeah, they <laughs> Punch them in the mouth. About three touchdowns. That's the, listen, this is their first time ever winning in Foxborough in ever? the history of Chicago Bears. That's a lot of history. You called that, though. Yes. You called that. Oh, I, <laughs> yeah. I was with you. This nigga was wrong. Hey, don't listen yeah. to this nigga C818. I'm like, they going to put everything on the Justin Fields deal a little better, bro. <laughs> He did look better. You said they ain't gonna let him win on him. They don't let you. They don't let you win. What y'all do tonight? Y'all better not let this motherfucker draw the field. Exactly. That's yeah. exactly what he Cheat, said. Hold, hold, pinch them <laughs> niggas, stomp on their nuts <laughs> in the huddle, and when there's a pile up, I know all the shit the niggas used to do in football. Remember that shit? You know that pile? Them niggas hitting you, pow, pow, pinching. You like, hey, with these bitch ass niggas. Get it was rancho home. niggas too. Hey, y'all rancho niggas, man. Sean, <laughs> motherfucking Lavar, and all you niggas, Justin. <laughs> that is crazy. North the County. Thursday night football game. Where we at? Baltimore, Tampa Bay. We talking about Tom Brady, sorry again. Yep, getting his 27 22. Ravens. At least they put up more than three points. At least they put up more than three points. Tracks. But they don't look good. And Tom, 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 Tom throws has been bad. He been <laughs> off like a mother. I'm like, damn, yo. He made fuck? all that in garbage time. Tom, I think, dude, it's seven games, and Tom Brady has been hit a fucking lot. Yeah, he is not used to that. Right. He's been hit a lot. And you yeah, he, see he, what see what you just said to me? What you just said was that line trash. It is you that name, line. You named yeah. Evans and Goodwin. And no, 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 no. I'm saying he got somebody. He, and all them niggas. People that say, well, he don't got nobody to throw the ball to. He got his boys like, back now. That they was out a couple weeks ago. Right. He got his boys back now. That nigga shouldn't have did the that line, shit They have problems with the line now. Yeah. Now it's all with the line. He getting hit a lot on the field. Hey, you know he can't run. Passes, but now it's the line. Stop giving this punk ass motherfuckers excuses. No, they, yeah. they look bad. They don't look like a good they team. Look like shit. Shit. Right. They look like shit. Right. They look like fucking Just keep it 100. Shit. We they, understand they, this is Tom Brady, but they don't look good. Just they like don't. they didn't look good his last year with the Patriots. At this rate, the Falcons <laughs> going to fuck around and win the division. Speaking of the Falcons. Uh-oh. And Dion. Carolina play tomorrow. The winner take the lead in the, a- in the NFC South, bro. Who they got with the, um, with the quarterback for Carolina? What's his name? P.J. P.J. Walker. P.J. Kalisimo. Uh, the XFL quarterback. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. I like that. He like, beat Tom he Brady, brother, bro. He a brother. I like when the XFL come in and the black men take over. I think the Buccaneers <laughs> taking, bro. Black men take over this shit. You think who taking? The, the Buccaneers. Buccaneers. Oh, they, that might be a good I strategy. I think they taking. They, ta- the they taking for... Uh, for her Don, for her Don Hooker, if from the, Tennessee. I need y'all analysis on this. If need some linemen, nigga. The Buccaneers do not make the playoffs without a hit on Tom Brady's legacy. No, no, 
Nothing could be a hit on Tom Brady's name. No, 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 no. I ain't saying they're going to make him be not the GOAT. But no. is it like, well, no. he did this, but he should have sat down right no. after this. No, because no. if you look at all the history, uh, you look, if you're talking to GOAT talk in all sports, even with Michael Jordan, Michael Jordan's last year was fucked. <laughs> that of shit course. was shitty. He could have let that shit off. But that's what I'm saying. Okay, but this he is still different. Mike. He, went, he won a championship. He's still on that same championship team. I understand that. Kobe Bryant. <laughs> the team trash. But what I, the point I'm trying like to make Kobe. is. Kobe the, team's trash. Kobe team was trash. And his last season. If your team. The best game he had was his last game of his career. <laughs> he scored, yeah, they well, dropped that six day. Yeah. But that's what I'm he saying. couldn't do shit else. Well, once, you, once, you get to a cer- once you get to a certain age, age <laughs> and years in like that, like something like this, they expect a decline to come. Right. It, it don't matter who you are. Nobody's undefeated against Father Time. So or when Mother that Nature. decline comes, it's, <laughs> I don't think it's, they're going to look at it as – they probably should look at it as a hit, but they're not going to look at it because he can overshadow it by so many of the great things he did. I understand that. I get all of that. Yeah. But you brought your ass back from retirement. It ain't like you just stayed on the team was going to go through that shit. You came back when you sat your ass down for a minute. Again. But they that should. Be, that <laughs> they should. They sh- it should. It, if you that, decide to come back from retirement, question? if you decide to come back, right. you're supposed to be giving an effort more yeah. than what the hell you giving right now. Oh, Absolutely. You tripping. You think Tom Brady slacking? Yeah, yes. He, yeah, he looks no, like he a little bitch out there. That nigga trying he he ain't slacking. He team hey, the hey, team trash, bro. Tom Brady. You looking you're not at looking good. See, that's there, what bro. we do. We look at quarterbacks and judge them off. And quarterback is the most dependent position on the field. That's the lead. I need these niggas to block. I need you niggas to run routes and get open. I need y'all to catch the ball. I need that's your fucking like, job. No, that's all their <laughs> job. His job is that if y'all all do that, now it's my job to deliver. If y'all ain't doing that, nigga, ain't nobody doing it. The job ain't going to – I can't deliver. I'm deliver. I'm sacked all the time. I'm on the ground. You know I can't run. <laughs> that ain't my fault. It was cool. I played quarterback, man. That shit this is, is motherfucking and position. This is what I'm <laughs> like other teams doing that same thing, you calling the plays that you used to call for a certain when you got a certain package on the field. You got some of those players missing now. Plus, you ain't got the same time but as a quarterback different. like you used to. You cannot call the same plays you were calling last year. But he ain't right. calling the plays. No, he's not. He's not. But he's Tom Brady. Hey, that shit is not gonna work, y'all. No, you can't always say that to the coach. Sometimes you got to say that shit in person. I don't feel like coach. You see how much time these bitch ass niggas give me. Why we call it We need to get the ball out faster But he gonna be like Well they gotta be open faster too So you can't just get the ball out faster And nobody open They ain't even looking for it It's a it's a rhythm game So listen Tom Brady I believe Is a professional He ain't slacking He going through adversity Which I don't know If he ever went through I don't can't see I don't remember I don't But yeah. The team ain't good So it ain't just Tom Brady's fault We be putting too much On the quarterback man Sometimes the team ain't good I remember Mark Sanchez With the Jets They looked good Cause he had and with Danny and Tommy, had some niggas over there. Then when they all left, they, was they ain't look good no more. <laughs> <laughs> so, quarterback is a dependent position. We give them too much glory and too much grief. But, on that note, our quarterback is mediocre. We'll take Tom Brady. <laughs> y'all would take Tom Brady. Because <laughs> yeah. y'all would have a great team. Y'all see Tom Brady. We <laughs> damn sure would. Looking like that. <laughs> <laughs> well, we gonna Tom be- Brady, come to San Francisco. You was at the first game anyway. You was at the catch game. I synced it. He was a little nigga, too. <laughs> Gonna get on these Eagles. The Six. Eagles trade <laughs> with the Bears for defensive end Robert Quinn. He Robert Quinn. One sack this year. Be at 18 and a half last year. Damn. That's a lot. He is going <laughs> to make them even more better than what the hell they are already. Yeah. That's – And and I – and I, So, I talked to my to my boy. Uh, shout out, Quine. What up, bro? Um, we was talking about this. Uh it looks like it's just moving money off the books. It's moving money off the books because he hasn't been, he hasn't had a productive year. Bro, they're going to get the Super Bowl. I mean, oh, they, I know they're going. Who I, is Akeem? Who gonna get the Super Bowl? The hell is his name? Akeem Hicks is Eagles gone. can get that. Akeem Hicks is know. gone from Chicago. Yeah. So they don't slid the the uh, pass protection to Quinn. That's why right. he ain't doing shit now. Right. He gonna get with the Eagles where everybody can get one on ones now. Yeah. And he's gonna excel. He's gonna destroy these fools. But this they, is, but they can't get that usage out of him. So if they can't get that usage out they of him, they get him. the money off the books. Right. That makes sense. I get it. I understand about the money. Yeah. I, money is this is, this is a going for a Super Bowl run right here. I don't right. think it got nothing to do with no money. 
No, he's talking about for the other team, right? I'm talking about, I'm talking about the Bears. He's talking about the right, Bears. Right, for the Bears. But you seen Roquan Smith, he thought they had a chance until they gave fucking up Quinn. Right. So Ooh. it's like, what the hell am I playing for? We probably got the best start off in the last 10 years right now, and you gave one of our best players away. And the Bears really ain't too – it ain't impossible for them to win their division. Yeah, I get nah, it. Nah, Minnesota's in the motherfuckers is four Min- games back. I know. <laughs> right four now. Four games back. <laughs> Seven but games. Four games back. It can happen. Sh- crazier things can happen. That it's shit ain't happening, We've bro. seen it. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll tell you what. Fuck that you. shit is not happening. <laughs> How about that? Minnesota are great. Get him, man. Kiss my ass. Motherfucker. They four games ahead. I'll just Seven say. Games hey, that's that, okay. that's that St. Louis nigga, man. That's that St. Louis nigga. My homeboy is out in St. My homeboy's oh out in St. Louis. He right. say, "Let me tell you ain't something. Ain't nothing in St. Louis but some ugly ass girl." <laughs> Rick, why it you say be. that? Is it true? It might be. It might be. Shit. <laughs> You're for the boy, I'm about. not from St. Louis, bitch. I'm from East St. Louis. <laughs> oh my god, you ain't never went over there. That's like saying I don't. <laughs> that's like saying North you Las know, Vegas. You, you hey, know, I'm from you, North Las Vegas. I'm from North St. Louis. Everybody don't just fuck with everybody from East St. Louis and St. Louis. You fuck around and get shot. I get you, bro. I'm just saying the chicks. <laughs> I don't be over there. Nigga, I've been in Vegas for 11 years. <laughs> Got you. So he said yes without also, saying yes. Man, yes, <laughs> probably. Also, with the Eagles. What up? They have the Saints number one first round pick this year. Mm-hmm. So what they're trying to do, they're trying to give it back to the Saints for Adam Kamara. They trying to get Who trying to get Alvin Kamara? The Eagles. They have the, they had a Saints first round pick. And the Saints ain't going That's nowhere right. this year. The Saints hey, ain't going nowhere. Saints, so they y'all like, better not give we'll up. We'll give you your nigga. pick back. They gonna give them up. Because they know they need them. We'll give you your pick back. If you give us Alvin Kamara. Ah, that's a good oh, that's a good that. maneuver. If they get Alvin Kamara, it's a, it's yeah. Eagles going undefeated, bro. It's yeah. trouble. I agree. They ain't gonna go undefeated, but they ain't gonna be problems for niggas. Because the NFC, the NFC don't look strong, bro. They yeah. gonna lose in championship game to us. It's all good. No, they, y'all ain't gonna make it to the championship game. Shit. What the fuck you talking about? This is me. I'm, I'm, I'm speaking it for the Cowboys game, fan, of course, but I'm speaking it without what I'm thinking. Right. It's like this. Okay. Teams like, okay, NFC East is running right now. With the Eagles being number one. Mm-hmm. Cowboys and the Giants, they running right now. We got to stack up to catch up with them because that they just did that without that. Now he just came back. Right. They gonna get their linemen back. They gonna get these defensive people back. Right. Then they gonna be ready with the people they have on their roster already. Yeah. Everybody stacking up to me. Cause you stay in the AFC. Everybody trying to get set for the Bills. Yeah. In the NFC, everybody trying to get set for the Eagles. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So it's like, and the Eagles making sure. You ain't gonna touch us. We got Robert Quinn. We they get Alvin Kamara, bro. Oh my goodness. That, that changes everything. <laughs> hey, I hope Jalen Hurts got weapons out the days already. If he gets right. Alvin Kamara, yeah, that, that is RPO gonna be, gonna be terrible. That is man. gonna be a problem for everybody. But I agree. Them niggas young. I don't know if they're gonna get to the Super Bowl and win it. I think they can do it. You, they they get, got veteran leadership on that team, bro. I think if they get there, they're gonna win. I think if nah, they I think nah. they're gonna beat the Bills. Yes. I think if they Hell get no. there, yes. they're I don't going think the Bills going to be there. You, or, or the so, Chiefs. So check this out. Check, so check I don't this think out. the Bills going to be there. Or the out. Chiefs, man. Nigga. I, check this out. I am, nigga. If you look at the top, the top <laughs> no, three defenses man. in the league right now are the Bills, the Eagles, and the Cowboys. Not particularly in that order. But those are the top three defenses. And who got the best quarterback so, out of all them teams? Josh. Josh Nigga, Allen is Nate the winning. best quarterback. <laughs> but they who, has, this and who back, is bro. the best overall team? Equipped team. That the would Chiefs. be the Eagles. Oh, right now, yeah, the Eagles. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm saying. If you if you match them up, Buffalo, they gonna stop Buffalo's Buffalo, run. I think Buffalo. Because Buffalo, Buffalo don't have a run. If they play right that now, shit I think they gonna beat Buffalo. Play them niggas. That's the truth. That's why Buffalo <laughs> always lose because they don't have the running back. They don't game. always lose. You nigga. need a running back when bro. they won the Super Bowl in the championship. They you ain't need won a running back. One. Exactly. That's my point. They, they stack. They can't. But they've been trash they since the last the Super Bowl. Running game. They're stacked right now. Nigga, they should have won last year. What? But they don't what? have the running game. Dude, That's they, why they lost. Exactly. No, like, that ain't y'all niggas know that ain't true. Did y'all watch that game last year? Yes. Ass, uh, Tell me what happened. It was a running game thing. No, nigga, it was thirteen uh, seconds let me, left. Let me, it was thirteen seconds left, my nigga, and they was up. Yep. Nigga, Patrick Mahomes did what he do. There wasn't nothing about a running game. Yeah, whatever. Let me tell yeah, you what. Let me tell you what happened. <laughs> Should next topic. Ah, <laughs> we'll get into that on another day. <laughs> but it's the I've been y'all saying that been for two years. Shit. We gonna move this up. NBA. We gotta talk about the Lake Show. What the fuck is the Lakers doing? 
Losing. Yeah, them niggas the worst team in the league. They worse than Sacramento, y'all. Fucking Sacramento. Listen to this. That's crazy. In NBA history, this is the worst shooting team ever of all time. <laughs> Damn. Them they niggas are 0 5 time. right now. Yeah. Westbrook shoot 12% from three. Anthony Davis. He need shoots. to stop shooting. Anthony Davis shoot 16.7. He need to stop shooting. Just from shooting. Them niggas need to stop it. 18% from three. Stop wearing three. LeBron calls. James is shooting 23% from three. Stop shooting. He averaging four turnovers. They fired Frank Vogel for the yeah. same shit they did last year. Uh-huh. And they fired him for this and doing the same thing. Yeah, that, they, so was it Frank Vogel? No. Thank you. Oh. We knew that, though. Yeah, of course. Y'all niggas didn't have the talent. And this nigga hurt all the time. And, and then you this got nigga the talent you did have. Exactly. That's Genie Bust or whoever the GM is. Whoever Genie needs to be telling the show now. All they're doing, we gonna let the bro get this Kareem record. That's he it. gonna fucking around and get injured playing like this. Yeah. Do they still be selling out? If they be selling out, then Genie yeah, like they that. Hell yeah, they selling out. Hell yeah, they selling this out. This is still. LeBron James. <laughs> Ain't nobody <laughs> sitting up there saying like I'm not. Tickets, yeah, them and Golden State. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Well, she getting her money. She like, fuck it. We losing, but we got LeBron and niggas coming. That's it. Like, coming, coming. Joel right, said we boycotting Laker game. Boycotting Laker game to further notice. Hey, man. <laughs> hey, I got, a, I got a hot take for all the ladies. And I'm going to say it right now. And I got it from another nigga from another podcast. His name is Ice from the Joe Button podcast. He said, listen, men are the prize, women. Y'all ain't the prize. We the fucking prize. I understand that. So... All that shit y'all be talking, we the prize. There. Now I'm done with my hot take. Way bigger than sports. <laughs> 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 Bitches. <laughs> Next we topic. Gotta, we got to get to your boy Russell Wilson. Oh, that niggas. Your boy said he was uh, to beat jet lag. He don't get jet lag. So he was doing high knees on the plane for four hours. What is wrong with him? Shut your bitch ass he don't, up. He don't, he don't like Sierra. Sierra don't like him. Sierra don't leave him. <laughs> This Dude, this what, this what why would you say that? This what we doing? No, bro? let's just think about why a nigga would say that. What would you think was going through his mind? Because he been getting shoot, shit on by the media so much about his play. He need them to think about something else. That was the stupidest thing to do. As far as I'm doing high knees on the plane. Motherfucker don't want to do high knees in their own house for four hours. And you doing it on the plane with a little ass out? Bronco Nation, right out. <laughs> that That's nigga, right. He was better off saying, I was just looking at my wife's ass. And admiring it on the plane. Oh, I'm looking at <laughs> film. No. He said, you know, I was looking at film the last hour, but I did four hours of high knees on the plane while everybody was asleep. But shut your ass, man. Man, that nigga said, if that nigga would have been high kneeing on me while I'm asleep, I would have tripped that nigga and made his ass fall. I don't believe he was doing that. And if he was, he shouldn't have been doing that. Somebody should have told him, boy, sit, sit down. down. <laughs> what the fuck? Get your boy, Sierra. They about to let them niggas sack the shit out of him now. <laughs> The yeah. offensive line about to be like, all right, let Please this nigga hide me. Let this nigga hide me past this sack. <laughs> Bow. Sierra wasn't expecting this, bro. No, he shouldn't have said that. He done got comfortable. Russell, <laughs> don't say that. Don't talk sometimes. Just be like, all right, yo, yo I was asleep too. I had jet lag. Just high shut knees up, on the brain bro. for four play hours. Play better. Stop it, nigga. I'm out of giving a shit. Right, if you play better, nobody actually ask you them questions. Yeah, leave you alone. But you got to play better. And I, I have know. faith in you, nigga. All these niggas around saying you corny. And I be like, okay. But he a baller. Now you're over looking like a corny baller. A corny unballer. Whatever the fuck. <laughs> Man, that shit trash. You got somebody challenging you, bro. <laughs> some men, some women are the prize. Don't get it twisted. Who said that? Nisha? Yeah. Nisha, you right. But. She out sponsored on Cuss Rap. And I'm, <laughs> I told her she was right. <laughs> Nisha, you right. And that's all I need to say. That's right. I'm going to get it twisted. And a few women. <laughs> a few men. <laughs> a few good men and a few good women. Chosen upon. We got to talk about your boy Kanye. What the fuck is Why? he doing? <laughs> Adidas. We got to talk about it. Oh, Trust oh. me. Adidas drops Kanye West for anti Semitic comments. Jalen Brown and Aaron Donald both lead Donda. Sports. Uh huh. Donda Academy is being shut down. Damn, they, they, the Jews, the Jewish people say, hey, we play all this shit. They, and <laughs> this, up, is, this is somebody they're going to definitely try to keep quiet now. He talked too much. They're going to make him shut up. They're going to try to kill Kanye. I don't think he's going to shut up. All the kids that went to down the school, they don't lost all these scholarships. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. All high school. And he lost his 
billionaire status. <coughs> right. He lost two billion in one day. So it's like I, I get I'm him like trying to do what he do and get in and stuff. You know, he got multiple streams of income. You know, <coughs> influential everywhere. But then uh -huh. he go and say this when you see other celebrities say something and get in trouble. But some of those people, I'm gonna say Nick Cannon, can come back from that. You can't come back from that. I don't Kanye think he cannot come back from that. Oh, he can. All you gotta do is put out a fire ass album, some fire ass shoes. Y'all niggas gonna buy the shoes oh, and yes. listen to the music. But uh, Diddy just got back. with the Yeezy. Hey, buddy, but you know what he said? No, this is another perspective that we didn't think about. You didn't expect. He wanted to get out of the Adidas contract anyway, and he couldn't find a way with his lawyer, so he did it this way. Now he could go do his own thing with his own, because he was beholden to them, because they had the manufact, they had the factories and the, the distribution. So whenever you sign a deal with somebody and they got the manu they manufacture your shit and distribute, you don't got the control. They got the control. Right. So he was complaining about that months ago, right? Remember, like they ain't saying they ain't got enough time. This, this, that. They was like, we doing our own shit. But when he said, okay, well, I need to get my own shit. So, uh, Young Thug told Kanye he could use his land. He got 100 acres in Georgia, in Atlanta, to mm -hmm. build his own factories and distribution center. Right. And he'll do it for free. That's what he said. We don't see if it's true. And I champion that. I think we need to be vertically integrated. That's what Nipsey said. Shout out to Nipsey. Rest in for peace. Real? But, Kanye, don't be doing no stupid shit if, again. <laughs> Because it seemed like Kanye had signed the deal, say he the richest nigga, and then complain about the deal he signed, and then try to get out. It's like a cycle of I dysfunction think, or I think Adidas got like chaoticness. A, they I don't got like it. The rights to the Yeezys? I they think? do. They yeah. do. Mm -hmm. But he can make his own new shit. They got I mean, to the old shit. He I can mean, make his own new shit and distribute his own I shit. Mean, and damn. they might, people gonna say, they ain't gonna fuck with the Adidas ones because right. it ain't Yeezy shit. You know how people are. People like, a uh, name brand. So yes, Yeezy shit going <laughs> You know what I'm saying? People like name brand, so that's what they're gonna do. So I champion him if that's what he's doing, but he still need to sit down. God, just do that shit in but in behind the scenes like Hove. Hove make moves behind the scenes. Don't talk about it and do all that. But see he got somebody by his side that gonna keep him fly. He don't. We got Antonio Brown by his side. Somebody that's just as loud as he is. He ain't got nobody. You mean Kanye? Yeah, he ain't got nobody to tell him, hey, bro, you doing too much. But that means he ain't, no, he ain't listening to nobody. I'm sure Hov don't have hey, nobody that's telling him he's doing too much. But he don't have nobody. They they Antonio Brown been, don't either. They have it. Has you been, say that, but, but about, I don't agree. He might be somebody trying to, and then niggas ain't listening. Check this out. <laughs> the only person that was able to do that was his mom. So when his Thank mom you. passed away, that's when we started seeing the decline the other side. of the mental health of Kanye West. So he don't have nobody because nobody ever is going to be able to take that place of his mom because she he was more she, like that. she was more than just his mom. That was his. That was like his best friend. To be honest, yeah. it was his best friend, um, his business partner. Like all his stuff that he did, he worked with that through his mom. That sounds so good. It's, but so it's, he got so, a daddy still. <laughs> his daddy there. His okay. daddy can't tell him what I'm trying to tell y'all is all oh, that sound good. He's not choosing to listen. Okay. So any Jay Z is OG and his bigger brother. Right. He could tell him, "Yo, dude, calm down, Kanye." But he ain't listening. But this is no, I, I get what if you're this saying. This is the thing. At the end of the day, it doesn't matter. We talked about this. We talk about this all the time between us and the and the fellas. We talk about this all the time. The young when we talk about the younger generations and how. They should be able to soak up this advice from us. Some of them ain't trying to hear us. Right. It don't matter what you say, they ain't trying to hear it. And it it, be, it really becomes down to people that do heed information and advice that you give and take. They hear it and they listen to it because they respect you as an individual. That's true. And if he don't feel like he has nobody that he can respect, you on can't that tell level, me that. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah, but that's going to be the downfall of a nigga. That would be well, the downfall it is. of a It is. You see what but he just said? If, he, if somebody was, if he had somebody this dude, he wouldn't have said no shit like this already. Right. I agree. He was already on I'm top. not blaming. Well, see, well, I guess the difference how we look at it is, you say he don't got nobody. I'm saying he not listening to him. That's the difference. That's the well, same I'm outcome. Saying, well, I'm saying, okay, I'm agreeing <laughs> with you saying he don't listen to him. But my thing, you don't have anybody to tell you that. When you when you do have somebody tell you that you don't listen to him, why the fuck am I there? All right. Right. That's why I hold just to play the back. <laughs> hey, let that nigga do out there. Be but, wild. And, but, then, but I ain't gonna say he ain't saying nothing bad about him though. Yeah. No, but I'm saying that he probably looking at him like, bro, you need help. This is where it's somebody who love you need to come in. Like, hey, you need help. I love you. But he got people around him probably that benefit off the shit. So that be the they difference too. They're not gonna say anything to him. But that's the industry. But that's why it gotta be an outside nigga who got itself. more money or the same. Absolutely. Money. The industry in itself 
put you in a position to where you don't have your people around you. You got people that's benefiting from you. So they're trying to tell you, hey, you need to do this or do this or that or whatever. And they ain't hearing none of the stuff that you saying. None of that your shit. complaints when you having a rough day, they don't care. The only thing they care about is getting Bottom their line. Money. Yeah. He ain't got nobody. But that's his bad. You gotta put people around you that it ain't his will. Bad. That is his bad. You can put people around no. you. And I and I say that Hove got it. But he ain't whole. But and he ain't gonna operate you. like whole. But that's, my, what that's the saying. point. But this is what I'm speaking to. And I'm speaking to this from someone that consistently struggles with my own mental health. The the contract I, I hear a lot so of people say, oh, you know, well, you need to have people around this. Sometimes we don't feel like it's nobody that's around that's going to listen to us or that even cares. I know y'all my brothers. I know y'all love me. Y'all got my back. We always roll. We roll together. And it's always like that. But at the end of the day, even I have my moments when I feel like, no, nah, I don't want to talk to Sugar about it. No, I don't want to talk to Kumeka about it because I don't feel like they understand. I don't feel like they care. I know you care, but that's when you're dealing with the mental illness part of it. I understand that. That's I all agree. I'm saying. I get you. But at the same time, Kanye has got a bunch of people benefiting off of him. So, so you're not going to say nothing to him negative is what we saying. I know. Yeah. yeah. That's why I got to be somebody like Ho. Because I ain't benefiting off you, nigga. I'm telling you man to man, brother to brother. I don't you don't, even like you, You don't bro. control me. Sit your you don't pay me. So I can tell you the truth. <laughs> right. You tripping. Charlemagne told him that too plenty of times. Ain't nobody listening to Charlemagne. Man, you right. need to listen to me. <laughs> well, the problem, well, it seems like the problem here is the nigga ain't listening. He so he's going to learn the hard way. You no. think he on, <laughs> Kanye came from nothing, bro. He talk about that shit all the Everybody time. Everybody did the in the game. Yes. That's what happens. We gonna move on from that. <laughs> Kanye, get your ass together, boy. Get together, bro. <laughs> we love you and we want you to Go be ahead and claim safe, that. but don't be doing the dumb shit. Go you ahead and claim it. Somebody. Mental <laughs> health, and we'll, we support you still, stupid ass. <laughs> but go listen gonna, to somebody. We gonna get some other dudes out here. Check this out. The Phillies won. First game of the World Series. Came Phillies back. came back. They was down 5 nothing. Houston. We got a problem? I can't stand your ass, problem. but do not let these motherfuckers win. <laughs> <laughs> Cheat, do we have, beat the trash cans again, do not let the Phillies win. <laughs> Look, that sounds like he hating on the Phillies. I can't stand the Phillies, bro. Boy, Philly, boy, they, they got heart, man. They beat the shit out of the Cardinals. They beat the shit out of the Padres. They just, I think they straight <laughs> here, man. <laughs> we about to move to some NBA. Chris Paul reaches 11,000 assists. Yeah. Damn, who's where's he at? On second, third, fourth? Fourth. No, yeah. third. He just he passed third. fourth. Third think, overall. I think John so Stockton. John Stockton, Magic Johnson, and yep. Chris Paul. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And y'all niggas tried to tell me he wasn't a pass first point. Oh, no, y'all didn't. My bad. Y'all yeah. niggas it's laughed at me when I said shit. I want John Stockton on my team. You all with everybody. We <laughs> still <laughs> laughing at you. I don't Fuck give a John shit. Stockton. Fuck you, nigga. <laughs> Dana White has approval to start a power slap league here in Vegas. <laughs> oh, my God. That's some white people shit. I'm going. That shit be wild. <laughs> you ain't never seen that shit, Q? Yeah. That Brian, shit be wild. I don't like <laughs> none of that shit. A power slap league, my nigga. <laughs> we need to get a... We going, bro. <laughs> Y'all going. gonna join? Hell no. I was about to cancel. I was about to cancel this show if you niggas would have joined the Power Snap League. If a nigga is steroid, I'm not letting no steroid motherfucker slap me. Ain't nobody slapping me. I'm shooting everybody in a 30 mile radius. Man, listen, my mama slapped me when I was 14, and I was was ready to fight her. And that was the last time I got slapped. But my dad. My dad, my dad slapped Rest me and I pulled my gun off. I don't think I ever oh, slapped. <laughs> Boy. That shit is a violation, nigga. Hell slapped. yeah. <laughs> you hey, gotta beat me That's up why tomorrow. when niggas was talking about they was going to start slapping niggas, I said, like, y'all niggas is lying. Niggas going to get killed. Let's <laughs> move it on. You can't just slap people. Paolo <laughs> Banchero. <laughs> Number one pick out of Duke, the Magic Forward. Sign a sneaker deal with the Jordan brand. Paolo Banchero. <laughs> Paolo Banchero. He should have went, went. went to Reebok like Jay. Allen Iverson, nigga. Josh Christopher, <laughs> a Rockets rookie, right? I don't mm-hmm. know if y'all know who he is. No. He's trying to shoot deal with Jordan Brand also. But check Trash. Me. He didn't want to do a docu-sign online. He wanted to go back to his mom, his grandma's house in Carson. Yeah, I seen and that. And signed it on her table, and they framed it above it. The- that's dope. Yeah, that's, that's awesome. dope as fuck. Yeah, that's that super awesome. dope. I seen that Shout video. out, Chris. Yes, sir. I like that, man. Back to the old school way. Too yeah. much new shit going on. And there ain't no rules. You new niggas ain't got no rules. It's your family, bro. Y'all niggas like men, family women, first. snitching, non-snitching, all <laughs> kind of shit. Like, what the fuck is going on here? <laughs> Since you know LeBron James and uh, 
Draymond and them brought a pickleball team, right? Yeah. KD did too. Oh, uh, them niggas is in competition. Right. But check it. Vegas is getting one. Ooh. A pickleball I mean, family fun center called Chicken and Pickle. <laughs> what? I like my chicken with no pickles. I'm cool. It's coming to Henderson in 2023 and located on St. Rose and Maryland Parkway. Yep. Park I know where that's at. We yeah. going. All right. I know, I know exactly where that's at. Pickleball? Like. Pickleball. They got everything but the NBA team in this bitch, but okay. They, they working we on it. They working on it. <laughs> they working on it. They working on it. LeBron James, break the record, retire, bring your punk ass here with the team. I mean, it ain't that hard. Right. <laughs> and then give us media passes. Everybody asking Pickleball. <laughs> texting me about these damn picks, man. So we can see Sage still. They won't <laughs> All right, let's, go, let's do this NFL. Let's do it real quick. NFL picks. Oh, we got NFL picks we coming off. We need to get a drop. That's Chicago it. Bears, Dallas Cowboys. Dallas Cowboys minus 10. Cowboys money line. Damn. Nigga, Bears points. Did right. The fuck? <laughs> the Cowboys fuck are they over. looking at? Raiders, Saints at Saints. One and a half Raiders. Raiders. I like the Raiders. They going on a, uh, they going yeah. on a six game winning streak. And Dalton starting, bro. Yeah, give me the Raiders. Pick six king. Raiders. Jaguars and the Broncos overseas. That's the Jaguars all day. Broncos Sunshine. ride. <laughs> Broncos ride. What do you say? Broncos, let's ride. Let's Broncos. ride. Let's fly. Sunshine. <laughs> yeah. That nigga's doing so, yeah. knee highs. That nigga's doing knee highs. Okay. Uh, remember, high uh, uh, again, Jacksonville Jaguars is one of the teams that's been London. playing consistently in Sunshine. London. They have a, it's like a home game for them. Um, take I'll take the Jaguars. I'm oh, taking them because I like Sunshine. You, and it's going my fantasy. And I'll take I'll take it over too. Vikings Cardinals. Vikings. Mm, what's the point? I'm taking the Vikings. Four. Vikings money line. Where are they playing at? At home? Vikes? Vikings. Vikings money Vikings line. Vikings money line. I got Kirk Cousins. At Miami, the Detroit. Line. Detroit minus four. What the fuck last spread? Uh, Who's Detroit? Back, right? Huh? Miami. Right? Two Miami. Back, right? Two back. Yeah, take Miami. I ain't going to ask you championship game. But Carolina and Atlanta, the winner is the sole leader in the NFC South. Atlanta minus four. What the fuck is this minus four shit? I'm uh, going with Atlanta. Uh, <laughs> I would take the over. It is over 41. I'm going with I Atlanta. I like that too. Yeah. Mariota. I like the Panthers too. Fuck the Panthers. I, I like the Panthers. Like the over. I like PJ. Oh, they got a black quarterback. The Panthers. He's stupid. <laughs> Mariota. <laughs> he ain't black, but he's, get, get him, bro. Get him. <laughs> Patriots at the Jets. Mm. Patriots two and a half. Mac Jones is back. J E T S Jets Jets Jets. Jet, Jet. Jet. Look, Go with the Jets. Mac Jones they came lost back. Greece. They did, and yep. they lost their left tackle. Oh, for that's, the season. that's that's not good. The Jets. No. Left yeah. tackle. Ah. Uh, um. Well, they benched uh, Mac Jones last week. Nah, I'm going with the like Patriots. Shit. He said they start. He said he's starting this week. So, with that being said, I'm taking the Patriots. I I'm, think this is a. I think this is a uh, statement game. I'm yeah, they got their ass whooped. They coming back. To I'm thinking he, he, he benched. Uh, I'm thinking he benched Mac Jones and put Zappy in, even though he did score, but threw three picks because he wanted that win over Chicago. I think. But, he just but went as out soon as Zappy came in, he started zoom zoom. Right, quick. and as soon as he after that, he started zoom zoom zoom. Pick pick pick. <laughs> But I'm saying I think he left him in because he wanted that win. Right, right, right. But he fucking up. The I think chemistry. Mac Jones is back. Yeah. And I like that. There you go. I agree. I like the Patriots. Even though. Titans I, minus one over the Texans. Why? Titans. Right. Why are they minus one? Who's right. missing? Right. Let me see this. It better not be Derrick Henry because I got nah, him in fantasy. Oh, Titans. Ryan Tannehill is questionable. He questionable. Who is they back up? Need question. Oh, that's true. The uh, boy from Liberty. Who the fuck? What's Liberty? Liberty, the school. This motherfucker school. know what I'm talking about. Anyway, I forgot his name. Well, that's Liberace. No, that's the nigga with what's the, the jewelry. Uh, Moving on, Eagles ten and a half five. over the Steelers. Jeez, that's a lot of points. I still like the Eagles. I don't like the points. I like over the Steelers. Steelers with the points is what I'm saying. Um, pick think, it to Pickens. Uh, I'm looking at this shit. That I'm taking the Eagles, bro. That shit look like that's going to be a trap game. It is. I like the Steelers all probably. points. Oh, yeah, you like me. I like the Eagles. It's a trap game. Eagles, watch the Eagles lose. I hope they do, but I like the Eagles. <laughs> <laughs> no, the Eagles ain't going to lose that game. They just took the Texans, the Texans Titans game to pick off. You can take Eagles. They took money. it off? They took it off. Oh, okay, that's better now. That's because just now know. they just did that shit. What game? The Texas the Titans, Titans the ones we oh, couldn't. Shit. The ones was Seahawks Giants. Seahawks minus three Giants all day. Mm. I'm going with the motherfuckers. The Seahawks at home. I'm yep. taking the Sea Chickens. I'm taking minus the three? Uh, Sea Chickens. I'm taking money. Oh, Sea Chickens. 
I'm taking the Giants money I'm line. I'm taking the Giants money line. See too. chickens money line. 49ers Rams. That's the second dance. We beat them the first one. Huh? It won one point. 49ers. And y'all got Christian McCaffrey, but y'all only favored by one. Nigga, because our quarterback mediocre. I'll Give me the Rams. I'll tell y'all that every year. Give me the Rams. The Rams, Rams at the, home. Nigga, it's the 49ers. They offensive line. That trash line the there. line is telling the story that you need to see. <laughs> Coats and Commanders. Coats minus three. I like the Commanders. Uh, but they got Heineke back, bro. Yeah, yeah. I'm telling you. They, they like Heineke. Yeah, I like the over on that game. I like Hell yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Because, matter of fact, Mac, Mac Jones, Matt Ryan sitting down. They yeah. got Ellinger playing. Right. So, like, the he, ain't pretty, he, ain't that, he ain't bad, though. Ellinger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like the over on that game. I like the under. Bills, Packers, 10 and a half. Bills. Bills. 10 and a half? Bills in the over. Y'all motherfuckers so disrespectful. Well, fuck Aaron Rodgers. Nah, that part. <laughs> nah, Aaron Rodgers is a bad man, but. Who gives a shit? Browns. Man, team ain't bad. They on a bad team. They, <laughs> they going to get their ass beat. In it, might not, it might not be 10 and a half. In Buffalo. In Buffalo. I, I think they're going to cover two. I think Buffalo going to beat the shit out of them. Buffalo. And it just came off a bye. I think oh, Buffalo going to cover two. Did they just come off a bye? They got the, the Packers. Bu- yeah. Oh, they about to destroy these fools. The Packers defense and offense is horrible to this year. But the Bills it, offense and defense is amazing. Monday Night Football, Cleveland. Bills. Cincinnati minus three. Cincy. Ooh. That's an over game if I ain't never seen the over. 45 points. I'm saying Cincy. I like under. over. Look. Cincy that's under. Shit, I, that's just going under. over. Cincy under. Cincy we under. Can, we can double up on that bet. <laughs> Um, no. Garrett, yeah. <laughs> we bet on the Raiders, the, the Rams 49er game, though. I'm with that, too. Jamar Chase. I got the 49ers. Jamar Chase is Rams, out, right? Rams, yeah. Jamar Chase is we out. We bet on air, nigga. <laughs> Deshaun Watson is out. <laughs> Deshaun Watson out? When he come back? Oh, Jamar Chase is out? Yes, sir. He is out. And still Joe, got, and Joe got is, Taj Boyd. And under, is out. nigga, in Cincy. I think I'm going to roll with him with the under. Okay. I'm taking over. That's all of them. Jamar Chase out. That's you got some five bets? Like double team. Yeah, we just did them. <laughs> all of them? <laughs> uh, no. Uh, <laughs> you know, better all of you. Uh, uh, college? Yeah, I got, I, got, I got a couple bets for today. Go ahead. Uh, I would take Golden State today. Golden State, I think they're going to cover. I feel like they're going to cover that 10 against Charlotte. Charlotte got some players out. Uh, I love the Bucks today against Atlanta. That's Bucks. NFL. I mean, that's NBA. In Bucks college, undefeated. Yeah, I know. Some of them might be balling too, even without even Milton. without Milton. In college today, I like Wake Forest. Yep. And I like. Hmm, that's interesting. <laughs> the over on the Arkansas State game. Okay. Those are two I got for college. I like Kentucky to cover against Tennessee. You think so? They got Georgia next week. They looking ahead. Kentucky might get them. Mm. 11 and a half. It was 13. I was 11 and a half. That means because everybody, I mean, everybody betting on Kentucky. Because it's a trap game. They got Georgia next. Right. I, I like Kentucky plus 11 and a half. I like, so, I like Coastal plus two and a half against Marshall. They might win outright. Right. Yeah. And I like Michigan with a Michigan 22 and a half. God damn. They going to blow their ass out. Who they playing? They playing Michigan State. Ooh. That's a lot of points, though. That's basically 24 points. I see another shootout coming. I see a shootout coming between Baylor and Texas Tech. Ooh. That's 61 and a half. I see a shootout. <laughs> UCLA, Stanford. I like UCLA 16 and a half. Yeah, me too. Um, everybody, that's the plan that I like already. But what about Georgia over Florida? It's twenty two and a half. Uh, if you buy, if you go to stations, I buy it down to twenty one. I think they're gonna beat the shit out of fucking Florida. They, they probably will, but I I play that one. I just buy that extra point and a half. No, I got you. At stations and get it at twenty one. I got you. Miami Virginia three three Houston South Florida forty two twenty one Auburn getting blasted thirty one to thirteen. Yeah. Shout out to my brother, the Auburn fan. I don't know why, but hey. <laughs> Keep going. Notre Dame is up on Syracuse, 31-17. TCU is up 31-24 on West Virginia. Heck, that's a good game. Yeah, they shooting it out over there. For sure. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in to the Undrafted All-Stars Radio Show. I am your host. I am Big Sugar, a.k.a. Sugar Doshi the Great, 
A.K.A. Great. to tell your friends about me, my co-host. Q Mecca, two techs up. You know, tragic gon' hold you down. And yo, I'm C4 Nate from the 618. Again, I sang my goddamn song today, damn it. Uh, I forgot my plug. Let me get this girl in real quick. Get the plug again. She playing get me the, the plug again. Where you at? Ladies! Black and veteran owned Bohemian style boutique specializing in handmade jewelry. Handbags and apparel for the ladies. Fellas, you can go ahead and hook your girl up too. Visit the Facebook page, Glam Avenue Boutique. Like and follow for weekly updates. Mention the Undrafted All Stars radio show ad and get 20% discount on everything you purchase. Yeah. Everything. 20%. Thank you for the sponsorship, Glam Avenue. That's $20 off a of honey. <laughs> For you niggas that ain't knowing no math. <laughs> with F. Math with F. Hey, it's Halloween weekend. All you ghosts and you ghouls and you goblins out there. Where the party at? We playing spades, beating niggas Be ass and dominoes and drinking no motherfucking eggnog because that shit trash. Right. Fuck the eggnog. That's because you trash. Fuck you, dog. <laughs> <laughs> we out of here. Hey, have Boss a great motherfucker. Where the fuck you at? We need our tuna fish sandwiches. We out here. <laughs> Do say. Peace. Peace.